All right, here we're driving in heavy rain. You can barely see the car in front of me. And I have, whoa, just added a lane there. Wasn't sure where to go. I've got rain on the windshield, so I don't have any windshield wipers. And this is version 2018.26.3. And it's doing a really good job. You see, people, there's a car up there with its hazards on. They can, they're can they going really slow because they can barely see on this interstate. It's 68 in Western Maryland. We're actually really quickly approaching that vehicle. I'm gonna change lanes so we can pass that vehicle. And there's a truck. All, everybody has their hazards on. Well, I'm gonna slow down. Everybody seems to have their hazards on all of a sudden. But this autopilot doesn't seem to have any problems driving in this. So I can just... I guess it doesn't matter if I can see the road, as long as that system can see the road. There's a big 18-wheeler with the hazards on. back up to pass this guy. We're just west of this LaVale supercharger, which is near Cumberland, I think. Just west of Cumberland, like a suburb of Cumberland, if there, if there is any of that. There's just a lot of rain right now. Draped over the concrete. down a steep grade as you can see I'm gonna lower the speed next six miles and you know with electric cars it doesn't really matter so much especially with the dual motor there's so much regenerative braking you never use your brakes even on the downhill so I think that'll be actually a big thing we're, we're thinking about that the all these runaway truck ramps so when you get electric semis I don't think they're ever going to need to run away anymore because they'll be the Tesla semi is supposed to have four motors on it. So I got two on this one that has plenty of braking. You never need to use the brakes on a steep downgrade. So if you got four motors, I think it still might be that you may have to use some of the brakes a little bit. Who knows? But that's a lot different than using the brakes all the time in a traditional setup with a semi. And the rain is moving away now. Slowing down. Yeah, we're just, you can see that gauge is way down in the green. We're going around a steep grade right now. Should be adding range now. I got 42 miles. By the time I get down here, I'll probably have more than 42. And not using the brakes at all. Oh, I have to get off. I gotta move over. I'm gonna get behind this truck. Oh, there's a. I might be using brakes there. I don't know. I need to get off. 0.7 miles. Well, I'm still at 42 miles. I didn't gain anything, but I didn't lose anything either.
All right, well, that's it for this video. I'm getting off up here for the supercharger. Thanks for watching. Actually, it must have recalculated. As you can see, I'm now, I'm off the highway. I've drove a little bit already, and I'm at 44 miles. So I've already gained two miles. I must have had to recalculate while I was driving or after I finished going on that downgrade.